What's up, y'all? We're going to be installing MobG exclusive graphics mod into 5M, and I'm going to show y'all how to use presets with it and how to set that all up. So let's get into it. You're going to head to the Patreon. You're going to click on this download link, and this is the main folder you're going to need. So once you have that downloaded, I mean, I have it on my desktop already. So this is it right here i'm gonna open it up you could either you open it with seven seven zip or runrar it depends on what you have um and if you don't have any i suggest using seven zip i have winrar but uh winrar has ads so i'd recommend seven zip so you're gonna once you have that open you're gonna go into number one and you're gonna go to this one right here and this one this file right here you're going to go to your 5m application data you're going to put it in your mods folder so most of the rpf files you see you're going to want to put that into your mods folder remember rpf goes in mods folder once you do that you're going to go back you're going to go to the next step number two you're going to click on that click on common data and then you're going to do the same here in your 5m application data you're going to go to citizen you're going to go to common data. You're going to drag all of these into here. Mine says replace because I already had them in there. And then you're going to go back to your main application data. You're going to go back in this folder. You're going to go to step number three. This is going to be your GTA 5 directory folders. You're going to drag all of these. This is the EMB. You're going to drag it into your GTA 5 directory, wherever you have that. For me, it's somewhere else because I moved it. Um, you can have it different if you have it on Epic Games or Steam. It's different for everyone. So once you do that, I click replace if you have to replace anything. Now you're going to go to number four. And this is basically all of the files that are in here. Instead of dragging it from here, you're going to drag the files from here. So basically, you're going to hold down control and you're going to click on all the files that you see in here, but click on them from here. So you're going to hold control. You're going to click EMB series. You're going to click D3, D11. You're going to click D3, D11 dot ENB. You can click these two, the complier 46s. You're going to click DXGI. You're going to click EMB local dot any EMB series dot any. And you're going to go ahead and con control C on that and put that all into your plugins folder in your 5M application data. Plugins, not mods, plugins. Now that you have that, you're going to go back and you're going to go to optional. These are the textures and all of that. So we're going to go to the mods folder. You're going to go here and you're going to drag all of these RPF files into your mods folder of 5M application data. And once that, let that load. Okay, now that those are all dragged in there, you're going to go back and you're going to go to exclusive volumetrics. And these are all of the custom volumetrics for the game. So you're going to drag that. And remember I said RPF goes in mods folder. This is exclusive lights. You could add that in there. If you don't like it, then you could remove it after but i recommend it no motion blur this disables motion blur because motion blur is already enabled automatically on um, emb with this mod so if you don't like motion blur or you don't want it then put this into there personally i don't like motion blur so i'm gonna move that into there now you have that done you're gonna go ahead and get into reshade so you're going to go ahead and go into the Discord. You're going to go to the announcements and you're going to see reshade setup. You want to download this file right here. Once you have that downloaded, you're going to open it up. This is going to pop up. You want to click OK. You're going to find your GTA in here if you have it, if you see it on here, or you're going to go to your directory. I have to go to my directory. It's already loaded up. You're going to, if you have to find it in your directory, make sure you click GTA 5.ext, not play GTA 5. So you're going to open that. You're going to click next. Make sure it's on Microsoft Direct X 10, 11, 12. Click next. M make sure modify is clicked, not update. Make sure modify is clicked. Click next. Um, you're going to do this later in game. Click next. At the top right, you're going to click unchecked all, check all. Next. 
let that install. Once that's finished, click finish. Now that reshade is installed into the GTA 5 directory, we're going to copy the files of reshade and EMB again into here just to make sure everything's working correctly when I, when we load up into the game. So you're going to hold control, click on EMB series, reshade shaders, D3, D11, D3, e, D11 EMB, D3, D compiler, D3, D compiler, and then DXGI, EMB local, EMB series, and then we're going to keep going down and you're going to get these three right here, reshade any, reshade log, and reshade preset. You're going to do control C, go over here, and control V and let that all go replace file destinations and then you're going to go ahead and load up 5m and it should all be loading up correctly now that you've seen it's installed correctly we're going to go ahead and make a presets folder and i'm going to tell you how to install your presets so you're going to right click on your desktop create a new folder and name it whatever you want I name mine presets so there you go um, open that up and then we're gonna go to the patreon so this is the one I'm gonna show you all how to install so you could scroll through all of this there's so many different ones you could get so many different types and they're all different but right now I'm gonna get this one right here and this one's meant for 5m so all the ones you see that say 5m are meant for 5m all the ones you see that say sp are meant for single player this one's meant for both so i'm click install you would install it i already have it installed so it's on my desktop right here you're going to open that up and this is how it works for all of them you're going to open this folder these are all just pictures the bottom file where it says preset any you're going to drag that into your presets folder after you've done that you could fill this up with however many you like um, you could click this right here, control C, this is going to copy, copy your directory to put it into reshade in 5M. So you're going to go to 5M. You're going to go ahead and click home, skip tutorial. And then click reshade preset right here. You're going to delete all of this and paste that new directory we have. And then you can click on the preset, click select, and then it should load the preset that you downloaded. So I just loaded up the preset. Now we're going to load into a game and I'll show you how it looks. All right, now we're loaded into game and this is how it looks. Uh, for my preset that I installed in this one in the car. Everything should be working good. Um, you could click shift and enter, make sure EMB pops up and uh, home. This is how you do the presets. You could switch in between them if you just keep putting presets in that folder. And then yeah, that's basically it. Thank you for watching. Peace out.